If you're looking to change a video background, create a video meme, or just practice your video editing skills, you came to the right place. Today, we're going to show you how to remove the background of a video with just one click. No experience is required, and no green screen is needed. Let's get started. First things first, we're going to be using CapCut to remove our video background. It's a free video editor that you can use on your computer, your smartphone, or through your internet browser. Today, I'm going to be using the desktop version. Once you open CapCut, create a new project, and import the video clips that you want to use. I have this video of two people wearing VR headsets, and I want to remove the pink background and add clouds in the background instead. Make sure to have your video clips ready ahead of time so you can just drag them into CapCut. Once your video clips are imported, drag the first video down to your timeline. If you want to adjust the length of your clip, you can drag in the corners, and if you want to zoom in a bit, you can adjust the scale slider. After making your adjustments, click the Cutout tab in the top right corner and click Auto Cutout. This is how you'll remove the background with one click. It'll take a few seconds for CapCut to apply the cutout, and after that, your video background will be removed. Now, move your video clip up one track on the timeline, and then drag down the second video clip that you want to use for the new background. It's important to make sure that this clip is layered underneath the first video clip. I can now hit the spacebar to play it back and watch my new video. It only took a few minutes and we were able to easily remove the background and add in a new one. If you're happy with the results, you can click export in the top right corner to save the video to your computer. Feel free to type in a title, then choose your desired settings and click export. Here's the before and after. CapCut did a solid job at removing the background especially since it's a free, easy-to-use editor. Well, that wraps up today's video. If you learned something new, remember to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.